Edgar Valdez Villarreal was a promising high school football player in Laredo, Texas, a city bordering the Mexican state of Tamaulipas. During his youth in the 1990s, across the Rio Grande, the powerful golf cartel was gaining strength in Nuevo Laredo. His football coach at the United High School nicknamed him La Barbie because of his good-looking appearance. However, while succeeding in his sports team, he was getting into trouble on the streets. By the year 2000, at the age of 27, he was operating a cocaine ring in Nuevo Laredo, Tamaulipas, with customers in New Orleans and Memphis. When American drug distributors traveled to meet him, he would pick them up at the border in a caravan of three Chevy Suburbans equipped with police lights and sirens. Some of La Barbie's security guards were Mexican law enforcement officers. Valdez set up this elaborate display to make an impression. He wanted people to fear him and know that he was in control and above the law. This is Illicit Investigations. Subscribe now to our channel to go beyond the headlines.